There is work to be done. What's up everybody? So we're gonna work today as fast as we can and as carefully as we can. I'd like to get my reduced reach kit on my bike today as well. Um, that's gonna require, that's probably gonna require the most work. So uh, we're gonna get some work done today. And you know, we're gonna, we only have so much daylight left. And uh, see how far we get. Uh, I'm kind of tempted to do the to do the reduced reach first today. The problem is, is I want to get some uh, footage of of me uh, riding as well. So we'll see. We'll see where we get. The next day. All right. So the big job that we did this weekend was the uh, reduced reach kit here for the. Uh, forward controls so if I can just get in here you can see um, that there's an extra piece uh, added which made it so that the uh, the brake arm went from oh, excuse me from this angle here to this angle here um, what that entailed was uh, Getting in here and accessing this, uh, I can't remember what they call this, but it's the lever that goes from the brake all the way back to the master cylinder. And I don't know if you can, yeah, you can see the master cylinder or it meets the master cylinder right in there. Um, that was, as you can imagine, a chore um, to get up in there. Uh, but it's, it's the difficulty though wasn't wasn't bad at all. Um, it's just, uh, you know, having to finagle your way through all of this to get to that. Okay, so that's that side. Alright, so this side was a lot easier, obviously, because there's less things to go through. Um, you don't even have to touch the, uh, I don't know what you call it, the clutch arm here that goes from the, uh, the, sh the, um, sh the shifter all the way back to uh, where it actually engages with the clutch. So. Um, this one was a little bit easier. Let's see if I can get in here. You can see all we did was add um, an extra plate here. So all the, what, what this does is not only does it, does it move the uh, controls back this way, but it also brings the controls, I mean, the, the plate is pretty thick, it's about that thick. It brings it out further away from the, uh, from the frame so my legs don't have to, you know, reach around this way. It's more of just a straight shot down. Um, so that's that. The reduced reach forward control kit has made riding so much more convenient. Before this, I was riding with like boots on and with sh shoes that had, you know, thicker soles so that I could reach better. Now, it wasn't, I, I didn't ever feel unsafe. I didn't ever feel like, you know, I couldn't reach even with regular shoes on, which I've done a couple times. But definitely it's, it's, a more convenient placement and, and and I wouldn't even I would venture to say it's it's like in the sweet spot now it's not just more convenient it's completely convenient I feel just it's just ideal now I'm wearing like regular little you know slip-on tennis shoes right now and it, the forward controls are hitting me right right in the in the middle of my foot and that's I mean that's perfect I am so so pleased with this modification so if you are on the fence about buying the the forward control uh reduced reach kit just do it if if it's, you feel like it's going to help you reach better or be in a more comfortable position when riding if you're a shorter rider um just do it it's, it's totally worth it again I, I can't tell you how worth it it was 
but uh, all in all, we're super happy with uh, with with uh, the progress on the motorcycle. If you are so inclined, hit the subscribe button for future or past content. Any content that you may uh, want to view later, you can do so if you hit the subscribe button, and then you'll know when the new stuff comes out. So guys, if you are riding, please, please, please be safe. And if you're not riding, you should also be safe, and you should also be good. I'm out!